was an accident, a horrible, bloody accident, and you've no right to drag poor Bella's ghost back from the past. Henry? Oh, it's all right, Catherine. This is Chief Inspector um, Barnaby. Of course. You're here to ask about poor Miss Simpson. I understand, Miss Lacey, that you don't live here. Not at the moment, no. I will do so, of course, after next Saturday. We are to be married then, Inspector. I live at Holly Cottage. It's on the edge of the woods. I share it with my brother, Michael. And where were you on Wednesday evening? On Wednesday? The night Miss Simpson was killed. Well, I was here. Well, don't ask me. I was sleeping all evening. You didn't leave the house? No. We've had reports that you were seen in the village, Miss Lacey. That's not true. Oh, wait, I did go out. I went into the village to post a letter. I took Benji with me. It's a nice dog. Oh, Benji! He's not very good with strangers. Are you treating everyone as suspect in this business? It's important for me to know where everyone was on Wednesday evening. Was there anyone else in the house? Well, only Phyllis, my sister-in-law. Sorry to interrupt. Uh, Henry, they're having trouble with the generator. They want to move it closer to the marquee. Well, I've ruined the speeches. No way. I'll talk to them. No, no, I'll go. you finished, I take it. I'd like to talk to Phyllis Cadell, please, sir. You can talk to whom you like. I'll take you up. We're all under a lot of pressure at the moment. How did you meet Henry Trace, Miss Lacey? He looked after Michael and me after our parents died. He was a sort of guardian. To be honest, I don't know what we'd have done without him. This is her room. Miles off Plymouth in the English Channel. Eddiston. Eddiston. Phyllis? Sorry to disturb you. It's the police. Police! Right! Oh! Uh, are you all right? Yes, yes, of course. Um, they want to ask you about Emily Simpson. Oh! Emily Simpson, yes. Why didn't I think of that? Thank you very much, Miss Lacey. Won't take up any more of your time. I suppose you must think I was quite startled just now. Uh, well, you see, the thing is, I thought you'd come about my car tax. It's been on my conscience now for weeks, and what with the wedding and everything, I... <laughs> Must be a busy time for you, Miss Cadell. Well, yes, it is. Well, I've looked after the house for seven years now, Mr... Uh, Barnaby, and this is Sergeant Troy. Seven years, yes. I came with my sister, Bella. And now this... Well, I never thought Henry would um, marry again, but I do what I can, even if I'm quite worn out. You were planning to stay on living here after the wedding, Miss Cadell? No, no. No, a house cannot hold two mistresses. Henry has a cottage on the estate, and I'm being pensioned off there. I I'm quite looking forward to it, and I'm sure Henry will be much happier without me. Uh, you want to ask uh, about Emily Simpson? Yes. Well, I'm afraid I can't help you there, not at all. I didn't leave the house that day and I didn't see anything. Well, I've been so busy, you see, what with the, uh, wedding. Everything. Oh, pathetic. Phyllis Goodell. That story about the car tax, she was scared shitless. Oh, you do have a way with words, don't you try? What are we investigating, sir? Emily Simpson or Bella Trace? Two unnatural deaths in the same small area involving the same circle of people. What do you think, Troy? We're investigating both. Mm -hmm. 